Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Lewis Jackson was murdered in Natchez, Mississippi on this day, February 27, 1967. He was 36 years old at the time of his death. A native Floridian and combat veteran of the Korean War, Jackson served as treasurer of the Natchez NAACP. In February 1967, Jackson was offered a promotion at the Armstar Rubber Company, a tire manufacturing plant in Natchez. Previously, Jackson's new position at the plant had only been open to white employees. Many of those who worked in the tire plant were members of the local Ku Klux Klan. Fearing for her husband's life, Jackson's wife pleaded with him to forego the promotion. But Jackson knew the 17 cent an hour raise would help him provide for his family and five children. After accepting the promotion, Jackson began to receive threatening messages at work. As he was driving home from work that Monday afternoon, a bomb exploded in his 1958 Chevrolet truck, killing him instantly. More than de four decades later, Jackson killers have evaded prosecution. I'm Tyrese Wilson, sixth grade student at Morgantown College Prep, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.